Hi, this is Mark Wu from eeprogrammer.com. Today we are going to talk about very simple um, curve fitting. So let us define a curve. Uh, we are going to use a sine function, but we are not going to plot the whole sine wave. So we are going to plot the degree from 0 to 100. This is a curve. We can co consider that is a simple curve. So how can we use uh, the curve fitting function in MATLAB? Here is the trick. In the tools, under the tools, there is basic fitting. Select basic fitting. And then you can see select data. Data 1, which is represent this blue line in here. So we can fit in a linear fit and it will come up with the red line. Um, it is fitting like um, doing the best fitting for this 100 point within a like, using a red line, uh, a line. So if we want to see what is the coefficient of this line, we can do a so equation. Um, sometimes you don't want for just only two decimal points, you can increase to three decimal points, even five decimal points. So if you think, oh, okay, um, a linear is not good fit enough, you can do another like four degrees polynomial. And then we are trying to remove the linear, so we can see they are basically as overlap. We can solve the equation. That is the equation for the polynomial fit of this specific function, which is like the sine function from 0 to 100 degree, which is very simple and very efficient. Because like, um, right after you make the part, you only need to go to tools, basic fitting, and then this basic fitting panel will come up. And then you can select like how many order you want, uh, how many order of polynomial you want, which is simple, easy to use.